The switch in my lamp has failed and I need to replace it with a new one. In order to do this, you will need to replace the whole light socket. I purchased a lamp socket at the local hardware store. This is actually called a phenolic socket. However, I will refer to it as a light socket. Note the anatomy of the socket. This is a threaded base. This will later be the means of mounting this on the lamp. This one has the push through switch instead of the turn switch. Start by unthreading the socket shell from the socket cap to access the terminal screws. Unassemble in this manner. The terminal screws are now accessible and ready to be wired. Unplug the lamp and start taking it apart in this manner. First, unscrew the finial and remove the shade from the harp. Next, remove the bulb and lift the sleeves on the harp. Simply squeeze the harp in this manner to release it from its position. Next, unscrew the socket shell to expose the socket. Then push a few inches of cord into the base of the lamp. This will allow enough slack to remove the socket from the socket cap. Simply grasp the socket and pull it from the cap in this manner. This socket doesn't have terminal screws securing the wires. Therefore, I had to snip them to release the old socket. With a pair of wire strippers, strip about a half an inch of insulation from the ends of the wires. Then twist together the exposed strands on each end. Next, remove the old socket cap by unscrewing it from the lamp rod. Now, take the new socket cap and send the wires through in this manner. Then, thread it on to the lamp rod. Hand tighten, making sure you do not over tighten and damage the threads. Now it is proper to tie an underwriter's knot with the wires. An underwriter's knot prevents the wires from being pulled from the electrical terminals when they are accidentally yanked. Here's how you do it. Next, take the new socket and a Phillips head screwdriver. Unscrew the terminal screws to prepare them for the wires, but do not try to take them all the way out. Do this to both the gold screw and the silver screw. Fashion a bend in the ends of the wires and hook them around the terminal screws in a clockwise position. This is done in order for the wire to stay in position during the tightening of the screws. Connect the wire with the ribbed insulation to the silver colored screw. These lines on the insulation identify which wire is neutral. Secure using a Phillips head screwdriver. Then connect the wire with the smooth insulation to the gold colored screw in this manner. Once again, secure using the Phillips head screwdriver. Next, pull the cord at the bottom of the lamp base to seat the socket into the socket cap. Use your other hand to guide the protruding switch into its designated slots. 
Now, take the new socket shell and screw it into the socket cap in this manner. Once again, do not over tighten. You don't want to damage the threads. At this point, it's good to test the switch to make sure it moves without issues. Next, reinstall the harp in the reverse order that it came off. Then, install the bulb and plug in the lamp. And finally, return the lampshade into place, securing it with a finial. With the new socket in place, the lamp can now be used.